If you suffer from allergies and want to stop using medications, then this video is definitely for you. In this video, I'll show you how to relieve your airborne allergies without the use of medications. The treatment we use is needleless, bloodless, and painless. And that's especially good when we're treating children. Hi, I'm Dr. Stephen Goldstein. I'm a chiropractor in Limbrook, and I want to explain how I've helped hundreds and hundreds of people stop suffering from their allergies naturally and without the use of medications. So what are some of the triggers of airborne allergies? Well, I'm outside, so the number one thing that comes to mind is pollen. There's also dust, dust mites. Also airborne allergies in your home. There's carpet dust, fabric dust, dust from your own clothes, dust from laundry, dust from your towels and linens. All of these are airborne allergies that are occurring not only outside, but inside your own home. If you have ever seen light coming in through one of your windows and you see those particles floating around in the air, that's dust. And it's in the air all the time whether you see it or not. If you see it, then those are the large particles you see. But there are millions of particles that you don't see. And that's what you're exposed to all the time. There are people that aren't affected by airborne allergies or even pollen. When people aren't affected by pollen, I like to call it pollen. But if you're affected by pollen, then I like to call it schmutz. Let me show you an example of schmutz. This is what I refer to when I talk about schmutz. This is what we're breathing all the time, every single day, whether we're outdoors or even when we're indoors. So here we have a table that has been exposed to the air for the last 24 hours. And this is what schmutz looks like. This is what we're exposed to and breathing in every day. But why is it that you're affected by this and other people aren't? So what causes an allergy? An allergy is caused by some type of error message. That error message could be an emotional stress, a physical stress such as a slip and fall, or a chemical stress. What do we mean by chemical stress? Well, that's the stuff that we're exposed to that we're breathing in, or stuff that we eat, the pollution in the air. Any one of those stresses cause an error message in the body which can cause a reaction where you're having an allergic response. And what are some of these allergic responses? Well, could be itchy throat, itchy ear, obviously sneezing, coughing, runny nose, congestion, respiratory issues. They can cause asthma-like symptoms. Um, they even can cause itching and hives on the skin. I've seen many patients that suffered from itching or hives, and it turned out that the culprit was allergies in the air. So what do we do to help patients with these allergies? Well, we have a simple technique. We hook you up to a computer. We put a band on your skin that you're not going to feel anything. And we can test for over 65,000 different allergies and food sensitivities, just to name a few. And what we do is we send a signal onto your skin we use a procedure called applied kinesiology, which is muscle testing. And we test to see what substances you're having a reaction to. We put that same cuff on your skin, we send the signal in, and then we stimulate different nerve bundles, acupuncture meridians along your spine, telling your body that these are harmless substances and you don't have to have a reaction to them. So just like your computer might freeze up, we don't know why, we hit the control alt delete button, your computer reboots, and it's working fine. Well, stimulating those acupuncture meridians and nerve bundles is kind of like hitting an old um, control alt delete button, telling your body that these are harmless substances and you don't have to have a reaction to it. So what's the difference between what I do and going for allergy shots? 
Well, first of all, the allergy shots, the protocol is usually once a week for five years. And they have a 40% success rate. Our protocol, depending on how many things we find that you're having a reaction to, is usually somewhere between 4 and 14 visits. And we have over a 95% success rate. Nothing is going to be 100%, but 95% and above is pretty darn good. So I want to thank you for spending this time with me. And I want you to like and share this video. I'm sure you have people in the family or friends you know that suffer from allergies, maybe even people at work. Share it with them. Maybe they're looking for a way to help and eliminate their allergies without taking drugs. So thank you again. If you want to leave any comments, please do so. Like my channel so we can send you more health information on how to heal your body naturally and without the use of drugs. Thank you again. I appreciate it.